Hey, uh, this is Aaron. Uh, this is a video tutorial for how to screencast. I'm in my office because I wanted to put this up pretty quickly. Um, but basically, when you're screencasting, what you're doing is you're um, communicating what you're doing on the screen to an audience. So basically, you're showing the people who um, are watching your video what you're doing on the screen and narrating to them what you're doing while you do it. Um, so basically, this is a video tutorial. So one of the softwares that you can use to screencast is called Screencast-O-Matic. And I really like Screencast-O-Matic because Screencast-O-Matic gives you the opportunity to download your screencast into a video file uh, that you can use to edit an iMovie or some other movie editing software afterwards. It's also really intuitive and it's web-based so you can do it from your browser. You don't really have to download a lot of the software. Uh, so anyways, uh, I really recommend getting into uh, screencasting as a way to communicate yourself online. Without further ado, let's check it out and see what I can use to screencast. Okay, so this is the Screencast Omatic tutorial, and uh, you'll see I'm at www.screencast o matic.com. Um, I'm also using Firefox right now because you need to have Java enabled in your browser, and Firefox really supports it in a good way. Um, if you don't have it enabled, just follow the steps on the next screen to enable it, and you'll be able to screencast in no time. But I've done that, so you won't have to watch me do that again. So anyways, to start recording, you just hit start recording one of these two boxes right here. So I'll hit this one. It's going to put this cool loading screen up. Um, it's going to ask for access from my computer, so I'll just allow it. And of course, it'll take this time downloading latest version. Uh, watching the numbers go through the screen. All right, uh, so anyways, then it gives you this cool box right here, and you kind of drag it around to wherever you would like uh, to record. Um, and you can resize the box also, like this. And then once you're ready um, to record, you just hit the record button right here. So, And you can see it's got the microphone and everything installed. So here's the record button. Three, two, one. Hey, uh, this is Aaron, and this is my screencast. You can see me moving the mouse around, and when I click, you'll see a little button happening. That's screencasting. Stop. All right, and then once you're done recording and you've stopped the screencast, you can just hit Done, and it will then uh, make a thing, and you can hit Play and watch it play back. Hey, uh, this is Aaron, and this is my screencast. You can see me moving the mouse around, and when I click, you'll see a little button happening. That's screencasting. Stop. All you have to do is go publish to video file, publish to YouTube, or f publish to Screencast-O-Matic. I'm going to choose publish to video file because that will give you an MOV file which you can use in your later work. So you do that and it gives you these options. MP4 is the one you want. Uh, definitely not flash. You can choose the size. You can scale it to various things. Add captions, notes. And then you'll hit save video and then you basically tell it where to save. Um, I would recommend to save it on your desktop so you can find it. And then you hit save and it'll save it there and you can work with that video later. Alright, and that's how to screencast. Thanks for watching this video tutorial. I hope it helped you learn how to screencast and I uh, hope to check out your other my other video tutorials on how to do WordPress, GarageBand, and other various apps.